In this episode of SNG Explains, we will discuss why France pulled out its troops from Niger. The French ambassador to the West African Republic of Niger flew out of the capital Niamey on Wednesday. The first sign that Paris may be getting ready to acknowledge that its century-old colonial presence is changing in ways perhaps never anticipated. France's 1500 troops are expected to leave in the coming months. Macron announced, quote, "We are putting an end to our military cooperation with the de facto authorities of Niger." because they don't want to fight terrorism anymore we are not there to deal with internal politics and be hostages of poichists unquote he preferred not to deal with the ugly realities of france's colonial hold over niger including burkina faso and mali that has seen paris control these countries by bribing top level political leaders who in turn gave france various favors Niger is one of the poorest countries in the world despite having uranium gold oil all valuable commodities but then they all are serviced by french industrial conglomerates and the proceeds go to france so people resent it and they consider this to be the reason they are backward The departure of the French has been widely welcomed in the streets of Niamey. The bitter irony is will the army officers now in charge behave any differently from the man they overthrew in a coup in July, President Bazoum. General Abu Rahman Ejiani commanded the presidential guard that protected Bazoum and is now in charge. All he has said about the future is elections in 3 years which may never happen. Uh, there are multiple reasons uh, for french withdrawal uh, firstly there been a coup against the previous president by the military and uh, military as well as uh, public apparently uh, wants to have nothing to do with the french military presence there are about 1500 french troops in niger to ostensibly to fight islamists and they and they have not been successful in curbing the islamists second reason is that president macron is uh, facing a difficult year in terms of uh, economy popularity at home and uh, imminent elections thirdly uh, the much wanted eco wars uh military intervention into niger to restore the previous president is nowhere nearby fourthly and perhaps more grievously there have been uh, demonstrations against french troops presence which are turning increasingly uh, volatile there have been public demonstrations in favor of russia and its state run wagner group an armed mercenary unit that is active in Niger and other parts of Africa they seem spontaneous but russia as a savior in place of france seems unlikely the anchoring of public opinion in favor of russia is more of an anti french sentiment than pro russian sentiment there there is the expectance from russia to fill the big boots of left by france but uh, given russia's own preoccupation with the ukraine war i think uh, it is uh, this expectancy is likely to remain unfulfilled russia may however sort of fill up the the, the economic boots not to leave out the americans who have a drone base near agadez in south central niger they seem determined to hang on there for the foothold it gives them in monitoring armed islamic groups in sahel region which includes niger they could strike a deal with chiani and after the departure of france the military junta needs new friends powerful friends the americans could be just what the doctor ordered 
Stay tuned for more such topics on SNG Explains. Watch the previous SNG Explains on our channel. We'll be back with a new topic for you. Till then, keep watching Strat News Global.